Hi Log Nuts, it's Janet from Canada. If there's nothing more manlier than grilling meat with a beer, it's storing your tools in this impressive log tool bag. It's called a puddle puddle dumpster something. <laughs> <laughs> it's a puddle dumper duffel. <laughs> puddle jumper duffel. It is so impressive, I've been told. Look at all these pockets. It's pretty sweet. Oh, it's magnetic. So this clips open. It's got two sweet bottle holders right there. I was thinking this is a bottle opener, but no. So I think it's going to lose a point for that. Just like that. Also, lots of other pockets. Oh, this one's magnetic too. I just noticed that. These are all magnetic people. Put some screws in there, whatever you want. Nails. We got a stud finder here. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, it's going off. <laughs> you know. uh, what else we got? We got a tape measure in there. We got a level, so make sure all your building stuff is straight because that's important. A big front compartment here. Hammer, screwdriver, that kind of stuff. And then the big compartment here. That's where all the big guns are. Just doesn't fit these puppies here. But then you got your drill. You can put other stuff in there, bags. Uh, we got our staple gun. It looks like a tackle box of like odds and ends and nails and junk. And then, a lot of sweet clear pockets there so you can see what you're looking for, screwdrivers, um, knickknacks, whatever. And then there's this, not a pocket, so if you put something there it's going to fall right through, that's deceiving. But then there's a pocket right here of nothing, but I'm sure you can put something in there. So you're probably going to want to hear my overall score on how I would grade this bag. So here you're in for a treat. So color, I'd probably give it a 2. Um, just because it's a great dark navy blue color. I mean, it's pretty manly color. Fabric, I would also probably give fabric a two because not only is it nice and soft, um, which is nice because when you have hard working man hands and calluses, it's good to have a nice soft bag. Function, I'd probably give it a two as well just because there's a ton of pockets and lots of space for all your tools and stuff. Uh, flexibility, I'd probably give it a two as well because not only could you use this for like tools and whatnot, it's a great spot to put all your beers in, uh, an overnight bag if you need. Fashion though, I would probably give it a half, maybe like a third, just because if I am going to take it on a job site, I would probably get laughed at. I would probably keep this sucker at home, in a closet away from eyes. No, I'm just kidding, it's not that bad. So all you men out there who thought about getting lug, this is a good starter bag for all your tools and stuff. And you can fit a lot of beers in there too. I don't know, okay, maybe a one. A one out of two. So total, my overall review on this bag, I'd probably give it nine brewskis out of 10. So you heard it from me, straight from the source. It's Janet from Canada. Take off, eh? What the f